Hello everyone, good afternoon and welcome back to my vlog. Today is the first day of our voyage. We left uh, San Vicente this morning, San Vicente, Chile, and now we are bound for Itapoa, Brazil, via Magellan Strait. Today I will be discussing with the pilots our uh, intended approach towards the Magellan Strait because uh, in a few days we will be expecting uh, heavy weather or some low pressure in the area. So there are two options. Uh, one is to pass through the first channel in order to shelter. And the second passage is the La Trinidad channel, which is farther south, in order to uh, have more shelter as the weather progress. So if we pass through these two channels, we will be safe and less exposed to the weather before we approach Magellan Strait. So in this area, it is uh, quite challenging as uh, since the weather keeps changing rapidly. So the communication between the captain and the pilot for our approach is, is very important. So later I will uh, talk to them while uh, they are here. I will call them on the bridge to discuss. Watch out. This is the first day for navigation. Weather is cloudy and the visibility is uh, about six miles. The swell is increasing and we can uh, feel now the vessel is pounding. Uh, because of her slow speed, uh, she's not pounding heavily. So she's just riding on the, on the waves and this swell. Swell is three meters. Uh, tomorrow and in the coming days, it will uh, get worse, as we expect from the forecast. Thank you. So the latest that we got from this was today, is that right? Yes, sir. Yeah. Every day we can we can get the weather information. Yeah. Close, yeah. yeah. So this is today. Yeah. Uh, UTC is minus three for us. So now we go to the second picture. So this is this was yesterday. This is today. So we are somewhere on latitude. What latitude, Zach? And we expect to be here. Latitude 52. Evangelista. Correct. So for now, Evangelista is on uh, five to six meters of waves. In 28. That is tomorrow. That is today. No, that's today. Today. Okay, let's move to 28. This is almost our time now. Huh? So we are still on green. Still okay. Three to four meters. What latitude now, Zach? Right now, sir, it's 38. So it's still on blue. Two to three. Mm -hmm. Tomorrow, 28, 1800, this is 28, 21, this is uh, 6 p.m. tonight, and this is 29, this is uh, tonight, 2100. Yeah. 3 to 4, and then you see the pattern. It's picking up, but it will dissolve in the evening of the 30th. We are arriving in Evangelista on December 1? December 1, sir. What time? Uh, afternoon? Uh, uh, noon time right now. Around, uh, let's say, afternoon. Mm -hmm. So this is... We will uh, arrive in the morning. 1600. Yeah, 1600. So this is more or less we are here. So we will feel five to six meters. If we delay a little bit, if somewhere in in uh, follows we we stop for a few hours, she will in the morning. Uh, she will increase. Yeah. But. But uh, to, to, to sail in Nigeria Strait with this day. 
on um, December 2. Yeah. We can. But how many hours are we gonna be delayed? I think. Uh, 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 probably December 2 in the afternoon. You will be disembarked. Disembarked. The yeah. time to yeah. disembark. To disembark. So, so. I, we will, we will, we can check the weather as it goes when we get closer. During yeah. when we get reduce closer, reduce the speed in order to, uh, to go straight on to the Margarita station. Yeah, yeah. Not go to inside. No. But now I'm already on uh, minimum speed. We are already steaming on a fire. So all I can do is stop. But this is not also. We can, we can go slow down. I will talk to the engine, slow down for uh, how many hours, just in order to, you know, in order to uh, be there on the first in uh, Evangelista. But uh, there's no need to to go inside the, the channel because I can see the, of course it's five to six meters. This is still still strong. This is still strong, especially with this condition. Either, either we stay in Falos only for shelter, and then move out, exit in Falos after uh, hours when we observe that the. But I'm looking at it in this. She will drop on December two. You see, December one. We are already. We are somewhere here. December 1, we are somewhere here. And she is on 5 to 6 meters. So that's pretty strong. Yeah. Check yung next na view. Next picture, please. Zoom in. All right, so this is the, oh, this is too much, no? That indicates a, how much is that? The wind is 45 knots, 50 knots, that's pretty strong. Okay. Of course, this is more worse. I don't like to be in here. I think this, this one is manageable. Five to six can be, we can manage that, but in her condition. What, what is the maximum as well uh, for your vessel? Huh? Four meters? Meter? Four meters is for maximum of five. But you see, the, if she is in loaded condition, I have no problem. Even five to six meters of waves, it's, it's okay. But when she is on light condition, oh, she's, uh, she can be, you know. She can uh, be like a paper when she is on light condition. At this time, we should be arriving with this speed. We should be arriving in Evangelista already. But we have to endure the endure the five to six meters of waves. So this is this is quite strong. And she continues until tomorrow, until December two, of three o'clock in the morning. So the whole night is, is pretty rough. Either we can go inside, uh, what is after Falos, sir? After Falos yes, is Trinidad. 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 You can, we can go in Trinidad. We can go in Trinidad and navigate there. Then we can exit exactly even Elista exactly on the on the time of this uh, without delay. Yeah. Around yeah. 1500. Yeah. We can be in Evangelista. We will have a few hours of rough. Or, yes. yeah, a few hours of rough sea. But, four hours, you think? Or, after uh, after exiting Evangelista, we will speed up. Give it a good speed and go inside. Yeah. You agree? Yeah. It's up to you, Captain. I will, in my opinion, that is the, the safest way, yeah? We don't go inside Falos, we go inside Evangelista. Ah, no, sorry. We go inside Trinidad. 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 Because it's a, it's a long stretch, of course, we get more mileage there. But it's more safer also. Yeah. It can change, you know. 
can, it can it can change but the way we look at it now with the projection with the forecast this is the the present condition that will uh, that we expect in in Trinidad uh, in Trinidad uh, area in December sorry, 1 this is December 30 ah this is November 30 sorry please ah, in in December 1 yes at, at noon in uh, this is a uh, uh, Trinidad area. I'm going inside. And the quantity of the swell is 5 meters. 5 meters? Yes, from, really from, from west southwest. Yeah, so it's pretty high. Huh? Yeah. 5 meters west southwest yeah. plus the waves. Yeah. So we get more. Then we can go inside Trinidad. Yeah. And pass there for, self, for safety. Continue with the uh, normal speed and we exit yeah. in Nelson. Nelson. Yeah. Okay. I will uh, send a message to my so where, 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 which latitude is this? In uh, yeah, 50. in uh, Trinidad. Trinidad, yes. Trinidad. 50. 50. Look, this so is. we feel it already in Trinidad. Huh? Even before Palos I think. Huh? Huh? Even even in Palos we will feel the the strength of the Palos? Uh, in Palos is the same. Uh, yeah, it's like the same. But Phallus is a very yeah. short. Uh, yeah. yeah. 51. Uh, and west. Yeah. West southwest. West southwest. Yeah. And the but it's well, but the. the. But the. Oh, the yeah. waves or the wind waves? The wind wave, the wind wave, the wind wave yeah. this is from from north from from northwest, northwest at the yes. back. Yes. Okay, I would say for now, let us. We, we can take step by step. Yeah. Captain. Or let's see how it looks when we when we are uh, approaching Phallos, and the condition is getting worse. Okay, we enter Phallos. Yeah. If oh, not, if oh. if it's manageable, and we feel it more stronger as we approach Evangelista, we go in Evangelista. Okay. Yes. Oh, not Trinidad. I sorry, sorry, sorry. Yeah, sorry. Not only that. That's my yeah, that's my point. Three course of yeah. action. Yes. First, we we Follows. aim. We see. We see if we can manage follows without entering. Yeah. Then we go straight. Yeah. If it gets worse a little bit, uh, uh, no, it will really increase. Then we go La Trinidad. Yeah. Okay. Yes. I will. I will uh, talk with the charterer. Give them. Uh, give them my uh, information. So they Okay, sir. Yes, thank you. All right, very good. Rapper. No, this is a big dollar. Here, more west. He here. Yes. Yeah. Yes, that's the that's the follow. That's where we enter. Forty-nine minutes. This is the latitude. Yeah? Yeah. Okay, sir. Let's send a message to the charterer to advise them that we we may have to enter Falos and uh, Evangelista. So send them also our uh, weather forecast. So let's send it to Amarek to Mersk, uh, Panama through Mr. Carlos Fernandez, right? So show them uh, November 30 and December 1. Okay. The wind and the the wind and the swell. 30 and December 1. So that was our short meeting with the Magellan pilots. And uh, based on our assessment, uh, we will approach the two, two channels. We will try to observe in the next few days how the weather will uh, increase and how the weather goes. And from there we will decide if we enter the Falos Channel and Evangelista. So these two channels are very important for shelter purposes. And uh, now, the second officer behind me is preparing the message. This is a standard that we have to inform. I have to inform the charter of my intention to deviate from the basis plan. So this is uh, part of the safety management system. I will inform my charter 
and also the owners. So, uh, basically, they will agree as it is the captains of the riding authority, but uh, they have to be informed so they will know the intentions of the, the captains. So, thanks for watching.